Boom. Flying solo, and I lost the little tripod thing that holds my phone up. So we're going to do the monthly update with the stupid setup over here. Blabbo, welcome to the monthly update. Same old, same old going on in the background. Not much changing over there. So I did get a, a rubber mat, though. People were complaining. <laughs> like, when you put stuff down on the thing, it sounds hella loud. It's like, oh, shit, that is loud. I'm sorry, here. Is that, that's slightly better. Keen insight to the background of the studio. Let's do some of these questions. Rumple Gold, what's going on? Just got a full-time job on a cruise. It sails around Hawaii. How do I vote in person in Hawaii? I don't know. I don't know. First of all, that sounds like an awesome job. But uh, I don't know how you vote in person. And I would make a joke, <laughs> but uh, I saw that they, they'd be throwing people in fucking prison for making election jokes if you are a conservative. When you're a Democrat, you can uh, vote and be dead. And nobody, you know, bristles an eyebrow at you. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, talk to uh, your employer. See how that works out. I'm not quite sure. Lost Elf, are, are you serious about moving to Montana or Wyoming? I hear really good things about Idaho. In the uh, northeast, New Hampshire is a passion of 2A freedom. Well, I ain't going anywhere on the uh, the east coast because that's just too far away. <laughs> it's just, uh, like, I'm lazy. I'm not going to go all the way to the east coast. But, uh, you know, people are always like, you know, Texas or Florida. The problem with Texas and Florida is that every California is fleeing California and they're going to Texas and Florida. So it just seems like a lateral movement. And I mean, Texas and um, Texas and Florida, they got a, you guys got a lot of electoral votes. So you guys are primed for getting a bunch of illegals dumped into your place to, to turn the place purple. And I just think like a place like Alaska or Wyoming. You know, the globalists don't care about those places. So, <laughs> and I'm hoping a good uh, a good winter kills off all of the weak Californians that happen to go into, like, Idaho. So, that's why I always say those places. But uh, I like a lot of what's happening in Texas and a lot of what's happening in Florida. It's just, you, know, you, you poor bastards are being inundated with Californians. Uh, Celtic Frost, if the Dems are blatantly voting for Nikki Haley to make Trump look weak, are you guys returning favor? MAGA returning fire against Biden. He's asking uh, as a Brit. It doesn't really work that way. See, one of the ways, one of the main reasons why globalists love lefties so much right now is because uh, conservatives are fucking busy. <laughs> we, we busy. We building businesses, starting families, raising families, keeping families from being turned into flaming commies. And so it's the left hand side is the only side that has time for stupid shit like this. Our side is busy, you know, being productive members of society, so it doesn't really go in that direction. And I thought that that listen, I don't know if it's illegal anywhere. I don't want to get fucking arrested. But Joe Biden is extraordinarily vulnerable in primaries. I mean, you could just if you got ten thousand people to write in somebody else's name, if they all wrote in somebody else's name, you could have a serious issue. But they seem to find uh, a bunch of write-in ballots. I, I shit you not. They found 50,000 write-in ballots for because Joe Biden wasn't on the New Hampshire. He wasn't on the New Hampshire ticket at all, so they had to do a write-in for him. And somehow they got 50,000 of these idiot, useless, moron lefties to not only go down there but write them in. I doubt that. Pallets and ballots, boys. But basically, no. Afro Sheen, why don't you have Sparkle Orange Eldorado on an airbrushed picture of you and the Soul Queen on the hood of an Aztec? <laughs> like Aztec art, lowriders essay. I would get an Impala. <laughs> I'd get an Impala Afro Sheen and I would do that. Nice orange, nice orange glow. I don't know if the Soul Queen would be fine with it, <laughs> but I would, I would try it. Hugh, what's going on? Hugh is saying, as a retired Boeing employee, leave Boeing uh, airplanes alone. I, I hear you. Uh, this is the same issue that I have with the military. When I, when I slag the military, you know, service members go, hey, leave us the fuck alone. I'm not talking about service members. I mean, I'm not talking about your mechanics at Boeing. I'm not talking about the people at ground level Boeing. The, the, the higher up executives are the scumbags who sold you guys out at, at Boeing. I totally get that. And, uh, you know, when you're doing a stream of consciousness, you don't have time to get into the nuts and bolts. And so it's just kind of a gloss over. But, uh, yeah, I, I, yeah, I, I imagine... You know, when you are Boeing and you're hiring a shit ton of people, there's going to be an aspect of it that is just HR. You're going to hire tens of thousands of people for, for answering phones and, and sending out emails and stupid shit like that. And a lot of these people are going to get a job because of their skin color. It's fucking stupid. 
But don't think for a second that some some of these mechanics won't also be hired because of their skin color. When, when you're a gigantic corporation, um, you know, hiring people is a big pain in the ass. And you're, you're seeing a lowering. That's the whole point with uh, DIE and CRT is it's the lowering of standards. And and these people go, whoa, 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 we mean lowering the standards. What lowering standards? For fuck's sake, you're not even doing grades in, in, in high school anymore. It, you know, uh, what, what would get you a, uh, a C in high school these days was an F 10 years ago. I mean, the, if they are even taking grades at this point. So there's a whole bunch of people who shouldn't even have high school diplomas. But yet they're going to end up getting jobs in these institutions that have lowered the standards. And now they're being picked because of their skin color. Well, once you're picked because of your skin color, you'll never get fired. And, and people know this. Hugh, Hugh is a normal person, I imagine. And Hugh's not understanding that uh, there's, you're a good person, so you can't comprehend that a bad person would totally take one of these jobs, slag the fuck off, and be like, well, I'm black, so they ain't going to do shit to me. And so that's going to make more work for the other Boeing mechanics. It's going to make more work for the other employees, and uh, tired, overworked employees are going to make mistakes. So it, it does, I'm not saying that a black person is going to crash an airplane. I'm saying this mentality of lowering standards – and screaming uh, that it's fine to lower standards because you, you scream about people's skin color, their sexual orientation, will have repercussions that, that go out like waves from a rock hitting water. And it could be tertiary. I mean, it, this could be uh, a failure can be from somebody 15 uh, people down the line, but he's fucking overworked because nobody else is doing the fucking job because everybody knows that they can't get fired because they'll just scream racism or oppression. So, But uh, yeah, I hear you. Nobody at ground level is making any of these decisions. It's the higher ups who, who've sold Boeing out. Kaku, what's going on? The man in USA was founded by some people like you and the others like you, the Sons of Liberty and Spirit 76. Glad you're considering new Monday afternoon show. Uh, it's not that I'm considering Monday afternoon show. Uh, it's that uh, we, we did a Monday afternoon show. And I was referencing that we used to do a Monday afternoon show. Um, but then we got kicked off of the place that we were doing. <laughs> it was a big fucking mess. And, you know, if I can, if I can, if there's a, if there's a story that breaks, especially as we're heading into an election cycle, I'm just saying that uh, I, I'd be more willing to jump down, uh, get over here and, and make a, a stream. But uh, appreciate, uh, appreciate that you love the, the show. The, the thing with the, the, the previous Monday show that we used to do was that back then it wasn't there's a there's a lot of effort and a lot of structure and a lot of planning that goes into these things. These are organized. They're like shows that that I'm putting together, and that Monday thing was just me. Just just I, I pull up um, some stories that I didn't get to in the stream. I just talked about them for an hour on the on the Monday show, and so they weren't the the amount of preparation and everything that goes into a restream wasn't there. And I don't. And now we're way 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 bigger, and so. Um, just doing all of that work to get those, those three restreams up, but then doing another show that's not that much, that that's not the same quality might impact, like it might, it, it might be confusing to people. So that's why we kind of backed off of that. It's, it's, you're either going to do all the preparation, all of the work necessary to make a really good show for that long of a period. Um, and if you don't, then maybe you shouldn't do it. Cause it might, it might. People might be like, what the fuck is going on? I don't understand what's going on. Why is, why is this, why is the Monday show suck? <laughs> why is the Monday show? Well, it's a different, it's, it's just me. It's my Tim Pool. I'm just going to read you an article. <laughs> I mean, uh, so I got to, I, I don't, I, I, I don't want people. There's a, there's a, from, from my perspective, where I'm coming from, it's a quality issue. It's a quality issue. I want to make sure that, you know. Two hour long show that that's layered in, in the way that's layered is going to be different if we just, just do a off the cuff Monday show, but we'll see what happens. <laughs> uh, again, in the, in the sense that it's election cycle, some fucking crazy shits pop it off. I'm gonna I'm gonna be like, well, I can either make a video about it for the uh, the 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 Daily Show, or I can uh, talk about it, but it won't be called a restrain. We'll see what happens. Uh, Pure Blood Ninja. Uh, I want to hear more about Disease X. Uh, Disease X is just a placeholder for for the next bioweapon that they want to unleash upon us. They don't have a, a good name for it yet. <laughs> but they got another bioweapon coming for us. That's for sure. 
Uh, Theron, this may be a dumb question. Just recently joined locals, uh, and I haven't seen any live streams there. Yeah, I don't put, I don't, I don't expand the live stream to locals because then it creates another chat that we need to have more people moderate, and then it's and it's 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 the same infrastructure as Rumble, and so um, when you create another platform. That's why we don't have the chat on on the Twitter thing because uh, I'm not gonna I can't put the show on more platforms where there's where there's chats because then it, it makes a vector of attack people go on there they start screaming um, you know let's kill some people and then they go oh well look this guy's doing a show or he allows people to say let's kill some people because because I don't have mods for that 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 platform or then I go find mods for that platform and it's just it, it's the same infrastructure as Rumble so I figured. You know, it's not different servers or anything, so it wouldn't be smoother. If if Rumble doesn't work for some people out there, and so if Rumble doesn't work for, I imagine since it's the same servers, locals wouldn't work either. So I figured might as well not do double duty. With that, uh, Rasput, what is your favorite type of fishing rod? <laughs> Long or short? Um, I I like I like revolver fishing rods. I can't explain why. I, I think it's because I played, uh, was that, uh, Cowboys and Indians as a kid. And we always had those little pop cap things that would spin around. And that, that never left me. I, I, you know, a semi-automatic is fine. A rifle is fine. These things are fine. But uh, there's just something that, that, <laughs> that appeals to the member berries in my childhood of a, of a cylinder spinning. And pop, 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 pop. You can't fuck up a revolver, by the way. When shit hits the fucking, when shit hits the fan, they're not complicated. They're easy to clean. There's no springs. Like, there's just, a fucking revolver is just so easy. Uh, Respoon, uh, or Salty Vixen, what's going on? Yeah, there's customer service issues. You know, with, with a lot of these sponsors, the, uh, like, like I, I have my mom buy stuff. And, or, um, you know, have stuff sent to her and, and, and like, I haven't had any issues with, with any of these people. These are all, these are all big name people. So if you've had an issue with all of them, boy, I would, I would get one of those ring cameras and take a look at your fucking USPS person. Um, I mean, these are all, these are all like big companies. We had an issue, we had an issue with one company and it was about them, uh, spamming people. And so we dropped them immediately. And so, um, I yeah, hope, hope you're, and we're pushing like for field of greens. I imagine we're pushing a lot of product. If there was a lot of issues, I think we would hear, um, so I'm sorry hearing about your, uh, your situation and G slice. Uh, why don't you follow me back on Twitter? I'm an OG when you were just a pop at 10,000, you better follow me right now. Uh, sorry, G slice. I don't, I don't use Twitter as a, um, like, like Twitter's not, Something that I use for uh, for fun or for like like Twitter's like work like I, when I, when I'm on Twitter, like it's just like I'm 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 looking for for articles or I'm looking for videos or I'm looking for topics for for the show and it's it's merely just uh, it's like a it's like a a work account and so uh, people get people uh, I'm sure G Slice over here is joking but some people I have had some people go why don't you follow me back I'm like. This is for work. Like I'm just this. This isn't for fun or pleasure. Like this is this isn't like I don't hang out on Twitter and 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 you know message people and talk and like no this is, it's work. Like I'm sitting there and I'm looking for s stuff and and trying to 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 hone in on on what is the political zeitgeist of the day based on what's happening on that platform and so that's why we don't follow that many people on that platform. It's not like that's not what I would use for entertainment or anything. All right, guys. But uh, boom! <laughs> oh man, <laughs> we're getting a good amount of questions over here. Thank you guys for uh, sending those in, and I hope I've answered them adequately for you. And I'll see you in the next monthly update. Take care, everybody. Bye.